Hello and welcome back to the Not So Berry Challenge. Ah, 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 ah. I don't even know what that was. I'm sorry. Anyways, we're still at Generation One, which is mint. There it is, the mint. So let's begin, shall we? We freaking shall. Okay, so first things first, there was a lot of people in the last video who was very concerned about Marcus because Marcus is aging rapidly. So I had a little looky at the sim lifespan and as you can see, the sim lifespan is at normal. But freaking but, I do have the MC command center mod. And in here, if you go to set age span duration, well, now I have fixed it. <laughs> I did it before I started this game because I was worried. I had um, set the age span for adults and elders to be lower than they originally were. I don't really know what happened there, but I fixed it. I fixed it. Marcus is now saved for a couple of days until he meets his timely demise. And I'm also sorry for all the other sims that um, passed away too soon, you know? So um, we're back, people. We are back. Right. Where did we leave off? So Mint is dazed. She still has her fear and we have 1,920 simoleons. Well, isn't that amazing? <laughs> and we're still living in this little jack. Right. I don't want Mint to get burned out because that means that we can't work and we need to work. That's your life, Mint. You need to work. So what shall I do about that? I know that you have to do something at least. <laughs> of course, Nora. Why wouldn't it be something you have to do? <laughs> Okay, I take a break or exercise some creative skills. Okay, we're not gonna take a break. Shall we do something creative, Mint? What is something creative to do? Playing the violin? The little violin that Marcus gave us? Is that creative? Who knows? First of first, let's go and eat something. Eat your salad. <gasps> Mint, you freaking... Are you seriously gonna eat on that freaking bench again? I just got you a table and... I'm about to leave right now. No, 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 no. Just because there's a plate on there? That you left. Mint, you left that plate and you didn't clean it up. And now you're gonna sit on the freaking bench. I just bought your freaking table. Look how many frick frack chairs and the places you can sit at. And she's gonna sit on that bench. Oh, there's a bird as well. I cannot believe you, Mint. I can actually frick frack not believe this. Yeah, and you're stinking. Good. Be stinking on the freaking bench. I Marcus Flex. Marcus Flex is wondering if I want to go over to his house and hang out. Oh, I guess we cannot. I waited too long. I'm sorry. Marcus has no chill. Marcus, Marcus, Marcus. I guess we're not gonna go over to his house and hang out, it seems like. All right, let's now see if playing the violin is good for our uh, little mental fog practice. <gasps> it is working. It's going down. That's exciting. I mean, Mint is not the best, is she? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, that's awful. I know. But her mental fog is going down, so uh, I guess it's worth it. Uh, you play that and I will stay out here for a while. <gasps> I am burnt out, but I did the violin thing. Did I do it for nothing now? Unbelievable. Mint is burnt out. Burnt out negatively impacts work performance and promotions. Well, amazing. Energy, fun, and skill gain. She'll recover over time, but taking breaks and relaxing will help speed up recovery. If Mint stays burnt out for too long, her condition may get worse. And she also acquired the violin skill. Wow. Okay, right. Does that mean that we can go to work or not? I don't know. I mean, I guess you can continue playing the violin. Oh, I also got it. I got an achievement. I've been playing The Sims 4 for five hours. I can promise you I've played more than that. I, I can promise you that. Okay, stop playing that violin. Oh, we got a breakthrough. Wait, what? Eureka Mintberry had her seventh breakthrough and wrote down an idea for a satellite dish. Oh, a satellite dish. What in the frick frack is that? Oh, but what I can do, I can put up my picture of Marcus and then I'm gonna sell the rest. <gasps> Should we sell the DNA sample from Marcus? <laughs> is that worth anything? No, it's not. Okay, that would have been kind of funny. <gasps> oh, hello. Selena Luke is here. Hello, hello. How you doing? You're looking fancy. Whoa. Whoa, oh. Um, okay, let's go to bed before you uh, <laughs> do something bad. Go to sleep, go to sleep. Oh. Oh no! You better not ruin my freaking stove! Go to sleep, go to sleep, little Minty. <gasps> Wait, we can't go to work? I didn't know that. Because she's burnt out. So I thought that she couldn't go to work. Well, we're gonna go to work then. Ain't nothing 
ain't gonna stop us now. We gonna work until we pass away. Right, Mint? Are you ready for the work day? Oh, she's just getting more and more tense from being here. And she's also got to pee and she's hungry. I mean, this is not a good day for you, Mint, is it? Well, let's go to the bathroom first. First, a freaking all. And then you can have a little strawberry. Is it good? Who knows? Right, so what do we gotta do? We gotta water our plant. We gotta upgrade the sim ray with mind control. Changing outfits. Well, that didn't sound creepy at all. You can mind control people to change their outfits. Right, well, let's do that then. <laughs> let's see, let's see. Let's put the... What did I call it again? Freezy McFreeze. That's the name I... Okay, right. I'm putting the freeze ray in there. And let's upgrade to mind control. Woohoo! What should we do now? What's like a relaxing taxing stuff to do? Water plant maybe? That seems relaxing to me. So let's go and water plant if we can. Can we? Oh, we can. Water. <gasps> oh no, by the way, by the freaking way, before I forget, oh my gosh, I almost forgot again. So from this lovely comment, suggested that I should use the little Simsy lot for this because she has built a lot that's apparently much better than the, this is. I mean, th this lot is bad. Let's, oh, hello, a creepy basement. I mean, this lot is kind of bad. So I do think the most appropriate thing to do is change up this lot to Lil Sims's version, you know? Oh, I don't have to dine out to be back. <laughs> Replace it! Okay, four build mode items have been substituted. What? What is missing? Is anything missing? Who knows? But, oh, this is looking cool. Got a shower area. Oh, wow. <gasps> we even got some cow plants. That's super cute. Okay, I like this. I like this a lot the better. <gasps> and we even got some more plants. Oh my gosh, we finally got a basil bush. That's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> right, what else do we gotta do? We gotta ask a co-worker for a medal. Well, let's do that. Alex Moyer, you... Alex Moyer is now the receptionist. They just switch around their jobs like... Blah, 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 blah. Okay, what about Marcus then? Ask for a metal. Come on, man. Oh, when well, a little hug. Give me the freaky frack metal. I got an arsenal. Food. So now we gotta tinker with the coffee maker. Yuki, yuki. Tink tank away, man. Come, come. Tink. Stop talking to the robot and go and tink. Go and tink tank all the way. Woo! Wait, hold on. Death is inevitable. Inevit- in That's another word I can't say. Inevitable. Inevitable. Death is something. Mint knows that. Mint just didn't think that she would be thinking about it so soon. There's still so much to do. How will Mint get everything done if death is just around the corner? Is it safer to just hide forever? Let's, um, not think about that. Uh, <laughs> let's go back to work, shall we? Let's uh, tinker with the computer. Where is the computer? Hello? There it is. Tinker. Right. Now we gotta analyze the plant sample with the microscope. All right. Which plant are we gonna analyze today? The blackberry bush? Yeah, we gonna do that. Come on, come on, analyze the plant sample. Ooh, Min's meticulous research has finally yielded spectacular results. A print of her discovery has been added to her inventory. Oh my gosh, if it's that creepy paint, oh yes, it's that one. We already have that one. I don't want it. I don't like it. All right, now we gotta take a DNA sample from a sim. Oh, Marcus, where are ya? Come, get your daily DNA sample. Where are you? Where is Marcus? Oh, he's on the toilet. Well, come, come, Marcus. We're gonna take a DNA sample. <laughs> Give me your DNA, Marcus. Thank you very much. Oh, now we have done all the tasks we need to do today. We're at the maximum level. So you know what that means? It means that we're gonna dig for some metals and some crystals. Our favorite activity. Come on, Minty Mint. Dig them all. Dig it, dig it, dig all the way home. Dig it, dig it, dig. As if your life depended on it. Ah, end of shift. And we made 562 simoleons. That's very good. Very good indeed. Right, I'm gonna sell all the stuff that we don't need. Black show. Okay, so now we got 3,243 simoleons. And I think I'm gonna save up that money before we start renovating this place again. Because you can't really do that much with the 3,000 simoleons, you know? So I'm gonna, yeah, I'm gonna wait. Wait and save and then I'm gonna renovate. That's me plan. Oh, Marcus Flex. Marcus Flex is wondering if I want to go over to his house and hang out. Do I really want to do that? I mean, I think we should because Marcus seems pretty desperate. Desperate for a way out. So I think it's only fair <laughs> that we go and visit him, you know. He does not want to be alone with those people. Oh, hello, Marcus. Oh, you're still wearing those clothes. I see. Right. His beautiful home with his beautiful family. <gasps> you know what? Oh, no! No! <laughs> oh, no, I left my freaking freeze ray at work. I don't have it in my inventory. I thought that I could, like, transform some objects here. But apparently not. I... No! 
of my freeze ray. <laughs> well, I guess we just gotta do some good old pranking then. Who can we do some pranking with? Mila? Yeah. Oh, Mila is very angry. Why? Are you okay, Mila? Are you angry because I'm here? Because Marcus invites me over all the time? Who knows? Let's lie about career and invite to fake party. <laughs> Why not? We gotta relax. We gotta have some fun. Okay, what if we play foosball? Play with Marcus. That has to be fun. Apparently, she's not getting less tense from that. All right. Ooh, they have some food here. What is this? Bison stew. I'm gonna grab a serving of that because I only have salad at home. Oh no, she's a vegetarian. I forgot. Oh no. <laughs> I'm sorry, Mint. Do not eat that. Oopsie doopsie. Yeah, Mint suddenly feeling some serious upset stomach. She may have eaten something made with meat. Oh, I'm sorry, Mint. I'm so sorry. I forgot. Oh no. Okay, let's go home. Are you feeling all right? Let's go to bed. I'm so sorry, Mint. Oh no. <gasps> oh no, we have brain block. Oh, but jeebus me. Means burnout became a total brain block. Brain block seriously impacts work performance and promotions, energy, fun, and skill gain. She'll recover over time, but taking it easy and relaxing will help speed up recovery. Doesn't mean to serve a break. I mean, does mean to serve a break? Does she do you, Mint? I mean, ah, maybe. <laughs> okay, it's it's the weekend now, so we do have um some days off. Two days off, to be exact. So I think we can do some relaxing, taxing, and that time you know it's all gonna be fine all fine and dandy oh and we also have some dust right well go and eat your salad mint from yesterday that's been sitting on the table for a whole night that's good what can we do that's relaxing maybe a spa would a spa day help i don't think i have a spa maybe i can put one in let's see spa i'm just gonna get the one from uh, max's because all the other spas that i could find uses a pack that i don't have you yeah, know so i think i'm just gonna go for the max's one it's probably okay a spa Boop. oh <laughs> Well, Minty Mint, now since the spa has plot down on us, let's do a relaxing spa day. What shall we do first? Meditate? Oh, Supriya Delgado. What do you want? Quick question. That's the hardest name I've ever seen. Ukupan... No. Ukupanipo? Ukupanipo. Heck heck yeah. No. Ukupan... Ukupanipo. Heck heck yeah. Ukup... No. Uk My brain is collapsing right now. Ukupan... Ukup I still can't say it. Ukupanipo. Heck heck yeah. And I will plan to spend some casual friend time together. Should I do it? I mean, sure. At, at this point, okay. I am so tired from saying that name. I can't even function right now. Meditating. Oh, our very tenseness is going down. A little brain block. That's good. Look how serene she looks. So serene and calm. What? While meditating, Mint Berry came up with a great idea for a new chemical connection. She is excited to share it at the next day of work. But aren't you freaking burnt out or something? I make up your freaking mind mint right what else is relaxing around here Ooh, we could get a massage oh that's expensive a swedish massage that's the cheapest one let's do that and we're gonna get one with morgan fires oh my god jesus you're here again oh she's pregnant oh <gasps> who's the dad who is it tell me okay it kind of makes sense that judith is here you know she's a spot person i feel like so that's okay oh minty mint are you having a relaxing time sit relaxed and taxing do you feel good i think so i mean our tenseness is going down that's good that's good. Um, no. Oh, okay. It's Christopher. I thought it was going to be Lou Howell, but it was not. False alarm. It was just Christopher. Oof. I was scared for a second. What else can we do? We can uh, do some yoga. Ooh. Yoga, yoga. Ooh. Krishna Mahayan. Do I know who that is? What? Do you wish you look as happy as I do? Well, you have the power. Just send one simoleon to me. Don't delay. Happiness is just a simoleon away. Well, you know, we do really need all the happiness we can get right now. So, uh, donate. Do we feel any happier? I mean, we feel fine. I don't know. Oh, Christopher Michelson. Hey, I met this person online and they want me to meet me. I mean, I got no time to answer these people. He just went away. Christopher Michelson got it chillax, okay? I mean, the romance festival is in town. So should we go to that? Because, you know, we need a little loving in our life. So I think, I think we should go for that. That seems relaxing. That seems fun. That seems cool. Let's do it. Ooh, here we are. It's really dark here. What shall we do? Ooh, we can pick some flowers. Harvest all. Let's get that money. You know, money comes first in this game. Money comes for crack first. Oh my god, Marcus Flex again. Marcus Flex is wondering if I want to go over to his house and hang out. No, Marcus. I, you, this gotta stop. I was at your place yesterday. No. It's not happening. Yeah, what should we do? We should... Oh. Alright, request romance guru's wisdom. We have to do that. I want to know. Love is often found in the place you least expect to look. 
Well, that wasn't helpful at all. It really wasn't. Is there any romantic interests in here? Oh, who's that? Are you a teen? Yes, you're a teen. So that's not gonna happen. Bernice Robles, that's the stalker. And she's also pregnant. You're also pregnant. Everybody's pregnant in this game. What is happening? What else do we have? Um, we have Bob Pancakes, <laughs> who's passed out. We have Judith Ward again. Oh, who's that? Miko Ojo. Oh, yo. Let's go and talk to her. How are y'all doing, Miko? Let's ask about career. That seems like a good option to do. Oh, she left. Miko left. Right. Maybe we can play some karaoke. Sing solo. Oh, let's sing a jazz song. I want to see this, Mint. Get up there. I mean, am I gonna get copyrighted for this? Who knows? I think you're doing good, Mint. You're doing a spectacular job at this. Uh, <laughs> oh, wait, hold on. <gasps> We're not burnt out anymore. Wait, what? Yes, we don't have brain block. We're not burnt out. I gotta say, the karaoke fixes everything. Wow. I'm gonna go home now. I'm happy. I'm content. Mint does not have a career in singing, though. That, that we do know. So let's go home. Wait, hold on. Did we get any plants that's on our list? Oh, we got a rose. So I'm gonna cross that off my list. That's very good. So I have my little rose right there. And I am gonna sell the rest for some sweet, sweet money. Boop. Right, I'm gonna get one more plant box like that. And now we have planted the rose bush. Let's water it. Wow, very good. All right, let's go to bed. <gasps> yes! Eureka, Mint Berry had her eighth breakthrough and wrote out an idea for a snake oil serum. Snake oil. <laughs> All right. So does that mean that we get promoted? <gasps> yes! We're gonna get promoted. That is exciting. Okay, let's do some chess because we do really need to master the logic skill that we do. So, play it up, Mint. Play it up. Agnes Crumplebottom. Hey, Mint. I think I have a crush on Taku Akiyama. Do you think it's worth a try? But what happened to the last guy? That Mateo guy? What happened to him? I was just moving on to another person. I mean, sure, go for it. Aw, I was kind of hoping that Mateo and Agnes would uh, hit it off and I would be invited to the wedding. But apparently not. Okay, Mint. What's happening here? Chat with Grim Reaper. I mean, do you really want to chat with him? <laughs> do you? Right, you need to go to the bathroom. <gasps> you know what I also want to do? I really want to buy a microscope. Where is it? It's in here somewhere. Oh, it's called an observatory, right? I could buy one of these because it's cheaper, but I don't think you get like the prints from it. And I do really want the prints. So backyard observatory, 1,500 simoleons. I mean, I think that's worth it. We are a scientist after all. So I think I'm going to splurge and I'm going to get to the microscope. How is our house looking? Yeah, yikes. Oh, we can now? No. I thought we could buy platforms, but we cannot. Because a tile system is gonna go crazy. But we can buy some half walls that we can afford. Or should I buy a fence? Is there a cool fence in here? Cool fence? I mean, that is not better. What about this one? Oh, that is taking up tiles? What? No. All right, I think I'm just gonna get a half wall because none of the fences uh, really did anything for me. I'm gonna do that. And then I'm gonna do that. And then I'm gonna do this. And I'm gonna move the wall like so. And I'm gonna copy it and get another wall. X show. And now it's still 32 tiles. <laughs> so that's good. I know I said that I was gonna wait until I start decorating, but it had to be done. It really had to be done. Okay, that's looking a little bit better. A tiny bit, you know. There we go. There we freaking go. Okay, man. Let's spy on the neighborhood. <laughs> I mean, you're not spying on the neighbors very secretly, are you now, man? <laughs> I think the neighbors know that you're spying on them. What is up with the windows? That's a very weird window placement. And is that Marcus? Oh my gosh, that is Marcus just strolling down. He looks so happy, by the way. Like, way too happy. What is going on here? He's way too happy. Is he gonna come knock on my door again? Yes, he is. This man. Right. Well, invite in, I guess. Come here, Marcus. Make yourself at home. And he's sitting on my computer. You know, I think Marcus just wanna be left alone. He just wants some spare time for himself, okay? He can't be alone in his house. Can't have a single moment of peace. So I think I think he just wants to sit alone on his computer. Not on his computer, on Mint's computer. Oh, now he's getting up and he's gonna play some chess. See, he just wants to be alone. Um, who's that? Eric Lewis. I haven't met him before. Why is he knocking on my door? Friendly introduction, I guess. What do you want, Eric? Oh, now Marcus is using the observatory. My gosh. So, Eric, um, what do you want? Ask about career, maybe? Oh, so Mint has learned that Eric is a stay-at-home dad. Right, so he also just wants some peace and quiet from his family. <laughs> 
That's why it's coming over here. This is a safe haven for stressed out people, I guess. Well, let's spy on the neighbor some more. Yes! We leveled up on our aspiration. And we reached mischief level 6. Wait, Mint can now use the phone to play hooky. <laughs> All the exciting things you can do. Oh wait, Mint also got a new fear. Disgust fear of death. Oh my gosh. Okay, so click on a ghost or elderly sim. And click on disgust fears under the friendly category. Alternatively, obtain a death flower and then click on the grim reaper and select give death flower. I like that one of those options were pretty easy. You know, it's easy to find an elderly sim and just talk about death. But obtaining a death flower and giving it to the grim reaper, that's not on the same level as just talking to an elderly sim. That seems super hard. Let's just talk to an elderly sim or a ghost. I mean, we already have a ghost in our backyard, so uh, <laughs> you know, that seems easy. Okay, what do we gotta do for our aspiration? Let's see. We have to clog drains at three different homes. I mean, Marcus, you're gonna get a clogged drain. Right, we also have to perform voodoo five times. Oh, a voodoo doll is really expensive. And we kind of spent all our money on this. So, <laughs> you know, we gotta save up for that. Right, and we also have to achieve level 10 of mischief. Ooh, okay. So let's start with the clogging of the drains. <laughs> I think that's what we gotta do first. So, you know, before the day is over, let's go and clog some drains. I mean, of course, we gotta go to Marcus's house first to clog his drain. Oh, hello, hello. Don't mind me at all. I'm just gonna clog the drain. <laughs> Imagine just going into somebody's home, not saying hello or anything, but just clogging the drain. <gasps> Wait, a fire? Who started a fire? Where is this fire? Eva discovered a fire. Oh my gosh. Oh no, Eva, what are you, what are you doing? Uh, extinguish, come on, man. Extinguish, be a hero. Extinguish the fire. No, extinguish, man. <laughs> Good. Oh, that was stressful. Did we at least clog the drain? Yes, we did. So that's good. Um... <laughs> I think it's time for Mint to leave. <laughs> I don't want to be here anymore. Uh, right. Who else do we want to clog? Pancakes. We gotta clog the pancakes house. It gots to be done. Oh, Supriya Delgado. What do you want? I'm delighted you recommended I spend some time with redacted name. I was amused the entire time. Okay, good for you, Supriya. Come, come in. Oh, I shall. Okay, Eliza Pancakes is in the backyard. I think it's time to clog the drain. Clog it. By the way, they have a super fancy kitchen. I mean, this fridge is super expensive. I mean... Oh, no, we got caught. We got caught. Oh, but it counted, though. <laughs> that it did, at least. It counted. Let's leave this place. That was awkward. Mm. Who else wants their sink clogged up? I mean, the goth household, maybe. Maybe, maybe. Oh, hello, hello. Knock on the door. Oh, it's so dark in here. All right, let's find the bathroom. This very empty bathroom with the balcony. All right, I have done the same. I can't complain. Well, clunk the drain mint. Get in here. Yes, we did it. We perfected it. Ooh, now we got to leave. <laughs> we got to go home. Right, that was it for this time. I hope you really enjoyed it. I really enjoyed it. I did. Except for the burnout. That was not fun. Stop being burned out, mint. Stop it. <laughs> Anyways, don't forget to like, subscribe because it really does help me out. So, um, thank you. But only if you want to. Only if you want to. And uh, I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.